Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we have a very epic video for you guys. So today what we're going to be doing is showing you guys the new Snake Prairie meta. Now I know a lot of you guys love this map and now I also know a lot of you guys hate this map. It's a love or hate map, not really any middle and we want to make you guys absolutely love it. So what we're going to do is teach you guys the new meta on this map. Gadgets have completely changed it and we're going to teach you guys how to win every single game. So that being said, let's hop into the games and show you guys what to do. Okay, so here we go into our first game. So we're going to be facing a Sprout, which is obviously really, really scary. But I don't think it's going to be that great on this map. So what Luki's going to do is essentially he's just going to use his bow gadget and we're going to just stand here. Now, usually you play with a Gene instead of a Piper, but a Piper is also a really good addition to this comp. So there, Tara is actually using um, the vision or her gadget very early on. This, I don't think, is the best move because it's just kind of a waste at the start. But we can see what's happening here. They do already have a really good lead, so... Oh no, my Wi-Fi. What? Do, oh, that's not Wi-Fi. I was like, why isn't? Why am I moving forward? But it's just because there's a lot going on now. Sprout obviously is a really good brawler, but I don't think it's going to end up winning them the game here. I think we're going to end up winning as the game progresses. So, anyways, Luki is going to go down over there, but that is fine. We're going to use our gadget over here. Move up over here, and this Tara is actually going to waste gadget, which is perfect. So she has zero gadgets left. We're down four at the moment, and they do have a Sprout, which is really scary, but I think we should be fine. So we got to figure out where their Tara is. We've just figured it out, so that's pretty good. Got to try and charge our super now. Only one kill behind. We still have our gadget, which is almost a guaranteed kill. Ali's going to try and jump away. I think she might be too close to the sprout. Not too sure. It looks like she isn't, so that's great. I'm going to be able to get my super over here. I might end up being trapped. Maybe not to try and run there we go i'm gonna be alive so i'm just gonna loop around this right side we have a lot of time left and we're only down by one kill so we can take our time we also have our gadget which is really good so again we're down to gonna loop around this right side over here try and catch them by surprise I'm gonna use my gadget obviously gonna go for the sprout because the sprout is the most we're gonna be able to pick up that kill I'm gonna run away from that tar I'm gonna be able to get that kill and now we're going to move back so 20 seconds left as i said we'd be able to come back the only thing I'm really afraid of is that Sprout. So Ali's going to be able to get that tap over there. We're just currently looking for the Sprout. I'm very close to my super, obviously, so that's good. Seven seconds left. Going to be able to get a couple shots. I don't think they have the time to catch up. Only if they kill me, but they're not going to be able to. And that's going to be the first game. So again, really rushed, really kind of crazy, but we're able to get that dub. They definitely took the wrong approach and just jumped out to the early lead. They weren't really stable for the entire game. And I said we were going to come back and win that game. So anyways, let's hop into the second game. Let's try and show you a more relaxed cycle of how to use this comp facing people who aren't really just pushing like crazy. Let's hop into it. Okay, so here we go into the next game. So we're going to be facing a good team. It's actually going to be Kano. You guys know Kano from, from some previous videos, so I'm not even going to introduce him. So Luki Bear is going to be putting down his gadget. And again, we're just going to stand here and take our time. Ali and Luki are going to guard the first star. And I essentially don't even have to play the game. I can just chill here and do nothing. No one's really going to run up on me. The last game was kind of an anomaly over there. But this Tara does know where we are, obviously, because of gadget. Uh, kind of a waste of the gadget use over there. So that's not that great. I'm only one shot, two super, so that's looking pretty good for us. Kind of an interesting placement over there by Luki. You definitely don't want to waste your gadget. And as I say that, I waste my super. Kano's out here, one shot. We should be able to get that kill off of a pinch. And we're just going to run back and charge our super again. So we haven't really done much so far this game. But to be honest, we still have three gadgets, and the gadgets are really what get us kills, so that should be fine. I'm going to back up over here just because that Tara does have super. Oh, I'm going to go down here for sure. Oh, I don't know why that Tara was so patient. I guess it doesn't want my two stars. It wants more, but anyways, I'm going to be able to use a gadget. Luki, again, using a little bit of an aggro uh, gadget over there. I would prefer if it wasn't as aggro, obviously, but that is fine because we still have two gadgets and not that much time left in the game. So uh, William is going to go for a Brock super. He's going to miss it on us. And we're going to move back. We're very close to our super. So that's obviously great news. Uh, we're going to be able to get it. We are pretty low. I got to try and get out of this mess over here. As we're not really in the greatest position. going to try and like sneak my way up. Holding out my super over here. Going to go for the pull on, over here on William. Going to be able to get that kill. Tara is going to go kind of for a Hail Mary pull. But it's not going to work out. And we are in a very good position with 20 seconds left. So I do have Gadget, so nobody's going to be able to run up on us and sneak their way up. Kano's doing a few wiggles over here. We're going to just go for that pull. 
he's William's gonna jump over it. We're still gonna be able to get that kill though. And we're in a great position. Now we might go down over here, but it doesn't really matter. We're gonna go down, but the game is gonna be over. So GG's to them. Again, a really hectic game. They're also using the same strategy. So you guys haven't seen the new meta versus the old meta. A lot of people have already adapted. But anyways, with that being said, let's hop into the third game and let's continue showing you guys how to play this comp. Okay, so here we go on to the next game. And again, they're gonna be using the new meta. So we're gonna be showing you guys again how to face the new meta. So again, stay in here, you wait. It takes about 20 seconds to charge anybody super. So we're just gonna stand here until about the 138 mark, cause it takes about two seconds to walk up. But we're just chilling over here. We might go for a shot over there against that Shelly. We went for it. Luki already got the kill, so it doesn't really matter. The bow is gonna go up and get a little bit aggro. So we're gonna be able to charge our super off of a bow instead of just standing there. Mine's in our spawn, which is actually very odd. We're going to move up over here. Going to use our gadget now. We're going to just get this easy solo pull. We're going to be able to get that kill. Luki's actually going to get it, which is even better for us, because that just means we can be as aggro as we want. But really good. So Luki's got five, and we actually have no stars right now. So that's actually fantastic, because again, we can just be as aggro as we want. So we're going to be able to hit a pull over there. We don't kill who we pulled but still get the value out of it. And we're actually gonna be ending up with two kills. They're just wasting gadgets without their supers. So this is obviously really good for us. Uh, really good start to this game so far. Ali's gonna break that wall and just basically completely block the entrance. We're gonna be able to know exactly where they are at all times now. So we're able to get our super. Bo's gonna run up. He doesn't know I have my super. I'm gonna be a little bit passive. I'm gonna go for the double. I'm only gonna hit the tar, but that's all that really matters because Ali's gonna be able to get those taps. And we're going to take a very huge lead. And Luki still has another gadget left to go along with myself. So it's currently 20 to 5. There's essentially no way that they're going to come back and win this game. We're just over here chilling, trying to get our super. One more beat. There we go. And then we're just going to walk up over here and go for a pull. We're going to use our vision. Deciding not to use a pull. We'll just wait for them to come to us. You don't really want to risk a pull, maybe not hitting it. Because obviously your pull is very important. So, just going to stand here. The Shelly thinks it's being sneak. Absolutely not. We're not going to allow it. We're going to get that easy pull. And that's going to be the game. So, there we go. Really good game over here. Yay, we're able to get seven stars. And it's going to be three wins and zero losses so far. So, let's hop into the fourth game. Let's continue and let's see if we can keep going undefeated with this comp. Okay, so here we go into our next game. So, these guys aren't using the strategy. So, this is going to be an epic game because they have a really weird comp. So... Luki, don't know where he is. I guess he's a bot or he's just seriously lagging because I don't think a bot would have done what he just did. I think he's just lagging. So we're going to stand over here. We're kind of bait at this point. We might end up going down to be honest just because Luki is literally standing here and we have no vision whatsoever. But let's see what happens. So it looks like Luki is definitely lagging a ton. So we're going to be able to get our super very soon. So let's go. I'm going to move up this right side and see if we can get a kill to start off this game. So we can already see one. Luki's trying his best. He's definitely lagging over here. Uh, so we're going to sneak up on this side. Pro has no clue where we are. Oh, it is able to find us. We're going to go for a double pull over here. Only able to hit one. Not going to be able to get the kill. We got some decent value on it, so it's not the end of the world. There's going to be a primo over here. Luki, shoot. Shoot, Luki. Oh, he's able to hit it. There we go. Luki's going to come back to life and be able to get the kill. So kind of decent over here not what we want but it looks like luki is back so we're just going to stand over here we're going to use our gadget was hoping to get a double pull not going to be able to oh but it looks like that was just bait and we end up going down to the m's okay so nice play by them 45 seconds left in the game although i do still have a gadget and i don't think the right side is fully blocked there we go yep the right side still has one tile of grass left to sneak up on so pretty good oh i guess there's someone right oh it's a primo no Oh, we just jumped out of my super. Okay, so this is not looking very good at all at this point. Fortunately, we still have a gadget. Uh, but I think there is a Primo sneaking around somewhere. Hopefully, we can get this crow. Come on, crow. There we go. We're able to get the crow. Looks like Luki is going to go down over here. Oh, Ali's going to get the tap. That might actually save us the game. Another great tap over there by Ali. We should be able to get this M's. We are going to be able to. And with just a few seconds left, we're going to use our gadget. Primo's going to jump on Ali. Ali's going to jump away. And Ali's going to be able to clutch this one. And we're going to be able to take home the W. So really weird game. Luki lagging. Primo jumping out of my super. No clue what happened that game. But we're going to be 4-0. So let's hop into the fifth and final game. Hopefully we stay undefeated. Let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go on to our last game. So they have a really good comp over here. So this one's going to be a little bit interesting. Luki's just going to use his gadget uh, over here. 
So again, we're going to be chilling about to like the 136 mark. Really early Tara gadget use. Do not recommend doing that at all. Just chill, get your super and use it when you have your pull. So we're chilling. We have about 10 more seconds of chilling. Idle. Don't want to get idle disconnected. So make sure you tap your screen every now and then. But one more tick and we're able to have our super. So Ali's going to break that left or that right side. Excuse me. So we're going to have to move down this side. Oh, that was a panic pull over there. And we're going to end up going down. Maybe we're not going to end up going down. But that's a waste of a gadget and a pull. Now, we do have the one nothing lead, so it isn't that bad as we broke that side over there. But please don't do what I just did ever. Um, you guys aren't going to see that ever again. But we're just chilling over here. Brock's going to be able to get a tap. Um, I'm spitting, so Loki drops his gadget. He's going to drop it, but we're not going to get great value out of it. And we're not in the greatest position over here. So I'm just going to sneak up over here. I'm going to pop my gadget. Going to be able to get one hit. Going to go for the pull over there. We're not going to be able to get that pull, but I'm going to hide behind this wall, which is going to allow me to not get pulled. We're going to take out that little Tara thing and, you know, decent position for us so far. Um, so, Luki's actually going to go down. Oh, this is going to be close for us. Okay, we're not going to go down, but a lot of grass is broken over here. We only have one gadget left, so this is going to be a little bit interesting as we have to make our way to them. We don't really know exactly where they are. Obviously, I don't want to just go up a corridor because it's going to be really easy for us to get tapped. Luki's going to go down again, so 30 seconds left. It's not looking that great for us. Not really sure if I should be using my gadget now or later. I think I should just use it now as an entry. Gonna try and stay out of this. Unfortunately, we're gonna get in it. So 20 seconds left. We do have our super. Let's see what we can do. We're gonna be walking up over here. 14 seconds left. Ali's still up. Luki's still up. Trying to make our way in there. Luki's gonna go down though, unfortunately. Gonna go for a pull, not hit anything, and we are going to lose this game. So they played this comp better than we did unfortunately we're not going to go undefeated this game but you know what if we're going to lose to any comp we are losing to the comp that we are literally showing you guys how to play without a piper instead of a brock but essentially the same thing but anyways that is going to be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed unfortunately we didn't go undefeated we did lose that last game but whatever you know it doesn't really matter as long as we lose to the comp we're showing you so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you smash that like button and hit the sub but anyways it's going to be it for today i will catch you guys again tomorrow peace